on your boat today. Thank you very that much. That was great. Yeah. Big day. Big day. It's a big day. Yeah. And uh, got a, every vote counts. Every vote. We got it. We, we, we had a couple left over if we wanted them, but we didn't need them. It was a very big day. Really yeah, great. Well, I appreciate well. your waiting. Well, I, I know the feeling. We uh, we have uh, challenges with our uh, parliament too. Right. We have uh, only 29 seats in a Senate of 76, so Ooh. we need a lot of work to get that legislation that passed. That means you're doing a good job. When you get it passed, you are. Yeah, that's right. Well, it's great to be with you. Yeah, great to be with you. Good on you. Good on you. We get along great. We get along great. Always have. Yeah. How important is the relationship with Australia? Oh, I love Australia. We have a fantastic relationship, but I love Australia. Always have. In fact, Greg Norman's here today, a friend of ours, and we have a lot of friends here tonight. A lot of friends in common. A lot of friends in common. Yeah. A lot of yeah, great you friends. Can put the refugee deal behind you and move on. Oh yeah, sure. We're gonna. That's all worked out. That's been worked out for a long time. Telephone yeah. calls. Telephone calls. Were really good in future. Well, we had a good telephone call. We had a great call. You guys exaggerated that call. That yeah. was a big exaggeration. I want to tell you, we had a great call. I mean, we're not babies, <laughs> but we had a great call, right? Young at heart, though. Uh, we're young, young at, at heart, heart though. Yeah. Young at heart. Uh, we had a very, very good call. That was a uh, little bit of fake news, <laughs> as the yeah. expression goes. That's exactly right. When can we expect you in Australia, Mr. Trump? Oh, that'll happen. One of the great, great places, one of the most beautiful places on Earth. And I have so many friends there. I'll be there. We'll be there. Absolutely, we'll be there. Well, we're, we're looking forward to it. Come here. Yeah, good on you. celebrating the Battle of the Cold Sea. How right. I'll happen? be speaking about the Battle of the Coral Sea tonight. That was some battle. That was a very important battle for both of us. It was. We did it together. We did. It was the, it was, uh, it, it saved Australia. Right. And it was the turning point in the war. And I was just up on the flight deck uh, with some of the veterans, American and Australian veterans. Uh, they were teenagers. Right. When they, right. when they, when they hmm. turned the war, the tide of war, right. and around. Australia and America started to win. So we've been allies for 99 years. Yep. Can you imagine that? 99 years and never yep. a bad time. So yep. it's a great, right. great thing. I think we'll get it through. The Republicans are very united, like seldom before. I mean, you, you see that today. The Republicans came together all of a sudden two days ago. It was like magic. They just came together. They're very, very united. Every group, from Freedom Caucus to Tuesday to every single group. A lot of groups, a lot of great people, but they're very, very united. You saw that today, and you'll see it again. Uh, the Senate is looking forward to getting it. Mitch McConnell knows how to do things, and I think we're going to have some really great health care for a long time. President Trump, what do you say to some of the congressmen who are concerned about how it will change in the Senate? Well, it could change a little bit. could get maybe even better. It's a very good bill right now. The premiums are going to come down very substantially. The deductibles are going to come down. It's going to be fantastic health care. Right now, Obamacare is failing. We have a failing health care. I shouldn't say this to our great gentleman and my friend from Australia, because you have better health care than we do. But we're going to have uh, great health care very soon. Obamacare is failing. The insurance companies are leaving. Aetna just announced they're out from Obamacare. Uh, some states, you look at a lot of states, a lot of different states. You look at Tennessee, you look at Kentucky is now in trouble. Iowa's in trouble. Uh, the insurance companies are all leaving. Obamacare is dead. So when you compare something to Obamacare, Obamacare is no longer living. And uh, we have something that's going to be, I think, one of the best anywhere in the world, and we look forward to Mr. it. Mr. President, can I ask you about your, your tweet on foreign policy and international issues? It's unconventional for a president. Is it an asset or a liability well, social for foreign media, policy? Yeah, social media is the way to go. Um, I've got over 100 million people watching, and social media, to me, is the way to go. And this way, if somebody's not treating you properly, or if you do have, indeed, fake media. Not all of it's fake. Some of it's fantastic, actually. But uh, you can just sort of circumvent. But, you know, I find — I don't know if you find that, but I find social media is the way to go uh, between the different forums. There are many different forums, but it's a fast way of getting the word out. I really think it helped today when — you know, on health care. I think it's uh, — it's a great way to communicate, and it's a modern way to communicate. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.